Hello everybody and welcome back to the new save file. Once again, we are going to jump in this time as... I don't know who has. We unlocked... Um, who did we unlock last? We unlocked someone in the last episode. It was Arachna. Let's do Arachna Greed Mode. Uh, why the hell not? Um, seems like it could be a fun one. We're going to jump on in as a character we haven't played as on this save file as of yet. But also, Greed Mode, I kind of want to uh, like push Greed Mode a little bit more and try and get Greedier unlocked and like the Lost Holy Mantle. Also need to do the Forgotten Unlock at some point as well. Um, yeah, uh, I added a new mod just like literally just like five minutes ago by the amazing James. Um, he's the person that's been making all of the uh, Synergy mods and a few other mods that I have as well. Um, but he made a mod that is the alt path for greed mode, which you may be thinking, hey, that already exists. And yes, yes it does. But, 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 this is a different version of it that is much better. Um, it's vastly improved. So now, oh, thank you. Now, um, it's actually an option to go to the alt path rather than it being completely random. And there's the opportunity to fight Mother too. Um, there's a bit, bit of a, a bit of a weird way of going about it, but you can indeed fight Mother, which I find very interesting. Now I don't actually know how the um, how the web sacks work here. Do they? Okay, they, I was gonna say do they pop at the end of the, each wave or not? But honestly, we might just be able to keep like one web sack up and kite enemies around it. That might be the better way to do it. But look at that. That is that is fantastic. You're gonna do your thing there. Okay. You're gonna do your thing there. Wait until he's in the webbing. Come on, come on. Come on. A little bit closer. There you go. Okay, I think this character is gonna be sick for greed mode. And I've actually never played this character in greed mode before, I'm realizing just now. Um I didn't really think about the fact that I hadn't before, but yeah, I haven't. Um and yeah, it seems like a pretty fun one. I mean, I love Arachna. Like I said, we unlocked her in the challenge episode. Was it yesterday's challenge episode or the one before? I can't remember. Either way, we're playing Ultra Hard. Oh my god. That challenge is going to be so fucking brutal. <laughs> I'm actually, like, <laughs> really looking forward to playing it again, though. I really hope you guys want to see more Ultra Hard, because it's just it's just brutal, savage punishment. And I don't know, I enjoy that. It's just, it's going to make me rage. I know it is, it made me rage yesterday. But goddamn, do I love a bit of raging. Like, I think, I think rage content is also just very entertaining as well. Um, especially when it's like natural, like it's not manufactured, it is me being genuinely angry. Um, do, 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 don't really care about that. Not really anything amazing in the shop right now, unfortunately. What we got here, donation machines and now mom's dresses. Uh, if this works in greed mode, this might be not bad, but I, I think that's pretty bad. I think that's pretty bad. Let's try and go for a reroll here. Um, I think Recycler's terrible. That's also terrible. Okay, we'll go for one more reroll. And Necrosis is pretty good. We'll try and buy Necrosis. Sprinkler's also pretty good, but I'd rather get Necrosis here. How did that enemy not um, have enough health to, to get, get webbed then? That was kind of annoying. Unfortunately, the webbing doesn't do anything to bosses, so there isn't really much point in us doing anything with that. Oh, bugger, you jumped right over it, you fat little fool. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it. As for the question of the day today, um, ooh, do 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 do. I don't actually know a good question of the day today. Hmm. What is something recently that you've achieved that you've been working at for a long time? What is something that you've, um, recently sort of done in your life or in a game that you've been working at for a long time. For me, like, work-wise or, like, life-wise, I'm, like, I I've been an operations manager at my work for a really long time, but I now actually have someone under me. I actually manage a specific person, which is, like, it's not, I wouldn't say it's ever been, like, a super big goal of mine, but it's something that I never thought I'd see the day of. I never thought that's something I'd be doing, and it's pretty cool to see. Like, it kind of means that I've definitely sort of rose up in the company I'm in, and, like, I've been trusted with a position of authority sort of thing, which I'm, honestly I have been for a while, but it's kind, of, it's kind of like, it validates it, so to say. It's weird how many things like that, like in your life or just in general, kind of, they are real and you know they're real, but until you get that, that, that proper validation, it's kind of hard to believe. I, I don't know if that's just me. I, I think that sort of de depends person to person. 
So this gives us two heart containers, two rotten hearts, a broken heart, chance to fire clumps that leave farts on impact, clumps kill normal enemies instantly. Okay, good. It does give us a broken heart, unfortunately, obviously. Um, but the ability to kill normal enemies instantly um, seems pretty seems pretty good. I don't know how common they are. I don't know if they scale with luck. I guess we'll see. Yeah, unfortunately, there's no reason to use our webbing here. And yeah, the Necrosis tiers there do help out with hitting bosses because we get the little poison farts. And it now means we've got a few different ways of laying out, dishing out poison, should I say, not laying out. Pretty good. Yeah, the dispatching normal enemies instantly is going to be really good for me, like champions and stuff. Slightly slow fight here just because we don't have great damage. This is not a hard fight at all, so I'm just going to kind of take it easy. That little dip over there can kind of do its thing. There you go. You going to do one more dive or are you going to start shooting again? You're going to start shooting again. Shooting's a little more worrisome for me. Especially when you get all the dips blocking my shots. There you go. We got you. We got you. Good, good. Devil Deal is definitely off the table for this character. We'll go straight to Angel. But as you can see here, now we actually have the ability to go to the alt path um, whenever we would like. I mean, this, this run, I'm going to keep it on the regular and maybe loop into the alt path later on. Um, if I, if I can do that, I don't actually know. But I, I really want to have enough money for a key here. I spent a little bit too much on that last floor. But it's cool. It's really nice to have. And then here, oh, the wafer. The wafer's so good. Although, I'm pretty sure with the wafer, we still take full damage on our webbed hearts. Because they just, they, they, depl they uh, deplete in one hit regardless. So I don't think it helps us at all in that regard, unfortunately. Right, I should really try and wait until I get my webbin going. We've got so many webbed hearts that, like, any webbing that we generate a, a sack off is going to create just a ton of spiders. Uh, what the fuck hit me then? I don't even know. Did an enemy just spawn on me? More than likely what happened. Oh god, I hate these enemies. They're so hard to hit. They move around so weirdly. And they do shit like that, you bastards. So all, all those webbed hearts I was talking about, they're gone now. They are gone now. So we won't be generating quite as many spiders as I, as I would have hoped, but still generating quite a few. Good, good. Good stuff. It does seem if we kill them with necrosis, it doesn't count, though, which is a bit of a shame. Right, what items we got going on here? Unfortunately, our items are just consistently bad. Uh, I will take Mother's Spine here, which I didn't realise was a reflected Mother's Spine, but that's actually kind of good as long as they don't lay on top of each other. They don't! Okay, that's amazing for us. Okay, basically we are a poison god now. Anything that even merely looks at us will be poisoned very, very quickly and very, very efficiently. We have just become all, all is poison now. Like, look at that, they spawn, the enemy spawned in and all of it's poisoned straight away. Also, the, the, the mother spine things do damage over time as well, which is really good. Good, good. And then for our potential angel deal, I really hope we get an angel deal here. Okay, this guy is particularly quite troubling. He can hit me very, very easily with multiple of his attacks. Luckily, it's not a champion version, but that does not mean that I'm not going to get hit by him in any way, shape, or form. Okay. He's honestly taking a really long time to die as well. We really don't have a lot of damage. Honestly, these mother spines are like the best bit of damage we've gotten in a, in a little while here. Yeah, this is taking a really long time.
Okay, we've actually got a pretty good rhythm with this guy. Unfortunately, the falling rocks are causing issues. Ah, he's finally, he's finally escaped. Just this attack. Don't like it, and it causes lag. Oh, that, that was a bugger and a half, that was. Okay, at least we killed him with that. But that was a bugger and a half. Right. We did get the angel deal, thank you. And we got cloaked, baby, which is pretty darn good. Alexa, come with me. And then... We got another one of these rocks. I still don't really know what these are from or what they do. I feel like I should buy a bomb for that, though. If I can. Which I don't... Maybe can't? Bugger, come on, give us a bomb. Okay, there you go. Bomb. I don't know if this is going to be worth it at all, but I feel like I should. Hey, we got a black eye and a key out of it, and we got another bomb there. So yeah, we do have the alt path there. I like the way that works. We're not going to do alt path this time around, though, but it's just good to have this mod on. Right. That is cool shades. I do not know what that does. Stunt kills. Extra range. So far, things ain't going our way, I'll be honest. Okay, we've got two damage ups here. We can get both of those this floor. I think stunt kills, isn't it like when we get a kill? Yeah, yeah, okay. Basically, when we get a kill, we use it in a very short period after the kill, and it gives us a damage up. And each time we do it, it has a chance. Uh, like, each each time we do it, the the time to press the button gets smaller and smaller until eventually uh, we lose the damage up. So we want to do it a certain amount of times and then stop, essentially. There you go. We lost it that time. So we got up to three there, though. Don't like you two. Oh my god, I really don't like you two. Okay, let's just stick at this damage. This is a, a big damage up. And we can just hold this for the rest of the wave. Because it normally only lasts a room, but in greed mode, the whole thing's one room. So it saves us some trouble, really. And yeah, it's a pretty big damage up, like a three damage up. Which is going to save us a lot of trouble. Also, the mother's spines push enemies away, which is really nice. Um, yeah, we'll go through here, and we'll go... This one for the potential soul stone. The next 10 seconds, spinning coins, that's actually really good. Let's do this in a smaller room, though. Okay, this has been very, very valuable. Very, very valuable. That was very good. And gulp held trinkets. Unfortunately, we're not holding any trinkets at the moment, so we'll skip on that. And then Loki's horns is kind of interesting. We don't really have to look for it, though, unfortunately. We get a little bit of damage there, but not a lot. But we got two damage ups, so... Ow. There you go. And we'll keep it at that. 7.82. Hello, good sir. I'm going to take you out. But I, yeah, I really like Arachna. Unfortunately, Arachna... I thought it was going to be really, really good on, on Greed Mode. And it still kind of is, but it's a bit cumbersome to use is the only thing. Like, it takes a lot of time for us to get good usage out of it. Also, the spine is having a real hard time hitting this guy. I think another thing I'm noticing as well is just... Because your spiders are so powerful, you start with slightly lowered stats. And that means our fire rate is currently terrible. Also, the champion version of this guy is taking a mighty large amount of time to kill. Like, look how much damage we've done to him. It's like nothing. Okay, we finally got him into second phase. That that helps a lot. Just 
get the spines pointed at him. Ow, walk right into that, why don't you? It's fine, our health is really good, so don't worry about that. Okay, and we got, oh shit, okay. Stay the hell away from Green Loki. Green Loki is dangerous as fuck. Okay, kind of can't stay away from him. Oh, luckily, oh, the double bombing, wow. Doing us quite the favor there, thank you. You've killed him for us. That is so generous of you. So very generous. I mean, I'll check this out. A key for some damage. We've got the wafer, so I think that is worth it. We also got Ceremonial Blade here. Um, Infix Bleed. All enemies that are bleeding will drip with the sacrificial blood consumable. That's maybe good, but I, I kind of want to stick on the potential chance to get an angel deal again. And then, yeah, items here are kind of dookie, so let's just go to the next floor. And there's the mausoleum there. Let's go for that. Hey, there's a soul heart back and a tiny bit of money. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Right, shop first. Unfortunately, nothing great here. Um, what of Tumors is a tears up. It's only a small one though, but I think I'll think I'll take that. A tears up is good. Better than nothing. Uh, baby, baby, baby. Hmm. I could grab PhD and then grab this. And then take, yeah, I, I might grab PhD first before I take those pills. Yeah. Why are not these enemies getting webbed? So many of the enemies just aren't being webbed, and I keep walking into things. I've dropped more pills. I keep forgetting that we've got the the mum's ba the, the the baggy buff that makes you sometimes drop pills. So that makes PhD actually really good. Yeah, for some reason, some enemies just aren't getting bag uh, aren't getting like webbed up, and I don't know why. It must be to do with the necrosis shots. Oh my lord. This guy needs to go right now. He was doing a number on me there. I've been hit a lot. I've also not been using my, uh, my sunglasses, like, at all. Right. Let me grab PhD. Champion belt's pretty decent. Luck upgrade's good. Luck. What makes you larger? I don't really think that's that's too good. Health up. Health. Speed up. Speed up. Increases tier size. Fish. Not bad. Quickly check out this arcade. Unfortunately, not a very good one. Uh, uh, what? I pheromones over on this one. It, Charmed the other. I got a good bit of damage going there. Okay, calm down you, calm down. I get a tier size up there which is deceptive because it looks like I've got high damage now. When I don't really. Oh my god. I only just slivered through because of the, the goddamn like... <laughs> the... Them bouncing off of each other, that was scary. Yeah, finally one of them got me. Oh, we got a tears up there. You see, this is already paying out so well. And the mother spine's bouncing the enemies back a little bit as well, which is nice from time to time. Right. Last one. Oh, it's the stain. And it's the reworked stain, or the slightly reworked stain, so. Gonna be kind of tricky here. It's got some slightly new attacks that, when there's two of them in one room, cause specific issues. 
So we really need to focus down one of them. Because yeah, these, these little whippies, you need to keep moving otherwise they will hit you. There you go, one's dead. So we got some damage out of those. Those cool glasses are pretty are pretty decent. Okay, got a devil deal again, unfortunately. Um that is actually actually fantastic, so we'll just take that. Um and then we're gonna have to be a little careful of our health going into future floors. And I think now is the point as well we want to start saving up money, so we probably want to leave it there. Unless there's something really good. We missed out on getting champion belt on that last floor, but it is what it is. That's very good. Not only is the halo good, but the money there is also very nice. HP up spawn a random object. This is solving our HP issues somewhat. Okay, those fires are doing a great job for us. I go for one more. There you go. That's enough damage. Okay. We've now got a really respectable amount of damage. Those blue fires are so funny. <laughs> They're just killing enemies that spawn sometimes. Oh god. What the hell's underground? Game, you could have told me they were in the room. I didn't know what the fuck was going on then. Well, that was rather easy on that front. While we've got all the damage stacked up, we need to keep this going. Okay, you two have uh, severely hurt yourself on the fires here, so... Congratulations to you. Some of these enemies are making this real easy on us. Reworked Conquest. Gonna be a slightly hard one in certain areas. He does have a second phase now. Don't keep doing this attack, please. Oh, you bugger! I wasn't expecting the, the the horsey boy to come so quickly. Yeah, luckily it's quite weak, so just get in line with it and fire. The seven seals, nice. Yes, just keep burning. Well, that was easy. I said it has to be something really good for me to take that, and it's unfortunately not. Right, down we go again. It's going good, it's going good. It's a good old classical greed mode run. Tears up. It depends on how much money I get, but tears up could be really good. Okay, that's enough damage ups. They're going to be a lot harder to receive when we go to actually fight the boss. Poison's going to do you guys in. Lovely. At this point, we're blasting through the waves. Still a little worried about my current HP. I'd maybe like to buy some more if I could. Good. Do you still drop bombs? No, you don't. Mm -hmm. 
this is a boss that I'm very, very much not familiar with, so... I know it's kind of like the version of the, the Shul one. Okay. Range up, damn it. Not really what we're looking for. You just... You just don't stay still, do you, bugger? There you go. Oh no, not you again. We've just had... A problem with you before. Come on now. Dude, every time. The moment he does that ability. The moment he does that ability, I just crap myself. Okay. Health is not looking great here. Health is not looking great. We do have a full health pill here, but that's literally useless to us. Right. Take him out. Good, good. Get a devil deal. See what it is. Unfortunately, that's about all she wrote, and there isn't much in the shop in the way of giving us something great. Um, it's a bit of a risk here, but I'm going to open up these. Oh, that one was crap. This one at least gave us HP. I'm going to buy that. And we're going down with only 56 cent, which isn't a lot. But I'll have to do. A free hug could help. Pretty good free hug. Right. Let's go fight the boss. Little bit ill-prepared for this. <laughs> Whatever we do, don't get hit on this. That would be really stupid. Ooh, that is that is a lot more money. Lovely. Oh, Hit instantly. We do have the way for remember, so that helps. Oh, one of those landed directly on top of me. Come on now, game. I've done, like, no damage to this guy as well. Oh my god. This is the worst fight I've ever had against this guy. Like, I am doing, like, no damage to him. This is going to be rough. Be a long, long fight. Oh, don't you dare do the keys, bastard. Coming along okay now, but... Dude, star. Too much shit for me to deal with. That attack is going to hit me every single time without fail. I know it. That one. If I'm close to him, I'm just going to get hit by it. It's so difficult for me to dodge that. I should get a little bit more damage up. That's the last time I'm going to do the damage up thing, though, because I'm going to fail it next time if I do. Dude, stop fucking healing. Oh, my God. This is so much healing.
I haven't even got him halfway dead yet. Do I have any bombs to work with either? Oh my god, how did I not get hit there? Bomb ones are not too bad. Especially considering the mother's spines are just pushing them away too. That helps a lot. <laughs> oh, that one did hit me. Okay, we're doing we're doing just fine. We're doing just fine. He's getting there. We're getting there. Whatever mother spine lines up, we do quite a lot of damage with that. <laughs> Keep doing this attack. This attack's fine. It's the keys and the hearts I do not want to see. What did I just say, boy? What did I just say? Oh, can you really stop spawning little shithead kids? I don't have any time for them. There you go. I've right, got a lot to donate as well. This is good stuff. Infested penny has appeared in the basement. It jammed after one penny. Are you fucking kidding me? One penny. It jammed after one penny. Is there any way I can cheat this? Because fuck that. That is bullshit. Right. Steam Workshop. Greed. Machine. Uh, can I find anything? to fix how it works. There's a greed machine rebalanced. Um, the machine is now protected by my mod. If the machine jams, the game will, game state will be revert back to an unjammed machine. Will respawn an unjammed state. You can donate up to 10 coins without, without it jamming. Each point of luck you have adds one extra coin you donate without worrying. After donating the amount of coins, any additional coins you donate adds 1% chance for my mod to lift its protection and let the game do its own jam chance stuff. I don't know, that sounds weird. I'm not really sure how that works. People are like, oh, why don't people like greed mode? Because of this. Because of this stupid bullshit. That should never be allowed to happen. I have 90 coins. I have 90. And you let me donate one. That's not funny. That's not funny at all. That is retarded. That is stupid. That is a word I shouldn't have used, but goddamn, I'm annoyed. That is silly. I apologize for using that word. Either way, that is just no. I did not like that. That is just, oh God, I'm so annoyed. I'm I do really apologize for using that word. I really shouldn't have used that word. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one.